<clears throat> All right, hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to yet another live stream. This is my first live stream, and I believe eight days. Last live stream I did, we were still in January. It was the thirty first of January, twenty twenty one. And this live stream now All right. is hey, now my first live cool. stream of Mom, February. Yeah, another live stream. As of time of recording, it is currently stream. Monday the 8th of February 2021. Thank you guys all for tuning in as always. And, uh... Alright, hey guys, how's it going? I'm welcome back to yet another live stream. As I was previously saying, the last live stream that I did of this game, we were still in January. It was January 31st, 2021. And that turned out to be a hell of a live stream. But I'm back once again as of time of recording. It is Monday, the 8th of February, 2021. As my first live stream of February. Thank you guys all for tuning in. The last time we left off, um, we were with Marcus. I think the female bot was called Kira or something along those lines. And I uh, can't remember what the other one was called. I think it was like Connor or something. Connor and Hank <coughs> in the last live stream, if you watched, I have quite a lot of beef going on at the minute. And uh, it's not good. Uh, Hank has a real hatred for Connor. If you watched the last live stream, Connor spilled his drink. Hank got pissed and nearly started a fight with him. And that turned out to be a hell of a live stream. But I'm back once again as of time of... Then Marcus ended Monday, up killing his owner's brother. What, well, not brother, sorry, son. Ended up killing his brother's son. Then Connor was trying to figure out uh, how to find out the whereabouts of a guy's uh, crime scene and ended up fucking the whole thing up. And Hank hates him now with uh, passion. As I said in the last live stream, the guy that voices Hank in this game, uh, I think his name's Clancy Brown, as the same guy that voices Mr. Krabs and Spongebob, for any of you that don't know that. So yeah, we're going to do this survey that they want us to do for Cyberlife. I got pissed and nearly started a fight with him. Would you consider having a relationship with an android that looks like a human? No. Do you think that technology could become a threat to mankind? And that turned out to be a hell of a live stream. Well, it depends what way you look at it. It could be. Then Marcus ended up killing his owner's brother. What not brother, sorry, son. Ended up killing his brother's son. Uh, a book, a cell phone, pen. Well, a cell phone and a console ain't gonna really do much, because if you're on a deserted island, you're not gonna get reception. So I'm gonna say an instrument. As I said in the last live stream, the guy that voices Hank in this game, uh, no, not really. As the same guy that voices Mr. Krabs and SpongeBob. 
Android flying cars, space tourism, brain connected device. I'd probably say flying cars to be honest, as cliche as that is. Yes. Oh fuck no. You'd have my children murdered before I got home from work. How much time per day would you say you spend on an electronic device? I don't know, like four four hours maybe? Depends what way you look at it. it could be. No, actually I'll say more. Probably more than four hours. Oh, it depends what the circumstances are. Well, a cell phone and a console ain't gonna really do much, because if you're on a deserted island, you're not gonna get reception. So I'm gonna say an instrument. Uh, to be operated on by a machine? Uh, would I agree to be operated on by a machine? Ooh. Would I agree to be operated on by a machine? I don't know what. That really depends on the circumstances. I'm gonna say, don't know. Do you think one day machines could develop consciousness? Yeah, I think so. Survey result, world's answers. A majority of people say I'd yes. I say I'd no. I was in the majority that say I'd no. For question two, I was in the majority that said yes. 20% say I'd no. Number three, I said an instrument. A lot of people seem to agree with me because they know what I. They probably thought of it logically like the same way as I did. As, if you're on a deserted island, a cell phone and a console is not going to get reception, so they're pretty fucking useless. Do you consider yourself dependent on technology? 75% said yes. I was in the 19 per no, sorry, 16% that said no. What technology do you most anticipate? A lot of people seem to think androids. Do you believe in God? I was in the majority. Yeah, I think so. I was in the majority that said yes. Would you let an android take care of your children? I was in the minority that said no. That's quite worrying. More. I, I, I was in vast majority of that, 61%. Don't know. I was in the minority of that. Do you think? Oh, I was in, I was in the majority of that. 66% agreed with me. Yeah, I know you haven't seen me for a while. It's been about a week. Do you consider yourself dependent on technology? 75% said yes. Hey, what's under X? No, sorry, 16% that said no. What technology do you most anticipate? Thank you, Chloe, that's very helpful of you. Do you believe in God? I was in the majority. Right, anyway, back to the story. <laughs> Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. 
Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigation. We contacted CyberLife for comment, but no longer. I also forgot to mention I already explained this in the first live stream, but this is one of those games where I can kill basically all of my characters. Either they'll all die, none of them will die, or some of them will die. And uh, if a lot of you watched the first live stream, you'd see that I killed Connor within the first 20 minutes of the live stream, and yet he somehow came back at near the very end of it. And uh, that's whenever he spilt Hank's drink in the bar. I don't know how the hell he survived the gunshot to the back of the head, but go figure. Look for the graffiti. Oh, right. Yeah, sure, here you go. Oh! Give him change! Or don't. Right, what? I also forgot to mention I already explained this in the first live stream, but this is one of those games where I can kill basically all of my characters. Either they'll all die, none of them Oh, it's right die, behind me. I never die. seen that. That is it, isn't it? Yeah, it is. If a lot of you watched the first live stream, you'd see that I killed Connor within the first 20 minutes of the live stream. And yet he somehow came back at near the very end of it. And uh, that's whenever he spilt Hank's drink in the bar. I don't know how the hell he survived the gunshot to the back of the head, but go figure. Find the graffiti. Look for the graffiti. Right, so some... Oh, right. It looks like a bird of sorts. Yeah, sure, there you go. That's it. Give him change. Or don't. Is that a bird of sorts? Right, what? I also forgot right, that's got a wee yellow marker thing. Whatever the hell that means. Basically all of my characters either they'll all die, none of them Oh, it's right behind me. I never seen that. That is it, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay, I can't leave this area until I find it, so... It has to find the graffiti. Okay, I don't need you telling me it in big, bold, blood writing. I get the point. And that's whenever he spilled Hank's drink in the bar. I don't know how the hell he survived the gunshot to the back of the head, but go figure. Find the graffiti. Where is the graffiti? Look for the graffiti. It must be beside this one somewhere. It's not here. Is that a bird of sorts? Right, right. Can I can I get back in the train and just leave? It says humans only. I forgot friggin' androids in this city have their own personalized trains. Right. Okay, I can't leave this area until I find Got like a wee so symbol thing in the top left hand corner. I don't need you telling me in big gold blood writing. I get the point. Right, I have to get uh, give him money and get him to move because I think he's in my way. I can't, physically can't do anything. I'm on top of one of these buildings somewhere. Where is the graffiti? Has to be. Has to be in one of these buildings. It must be beside this one somewhere. It's on the pole. It's not here. Oh, that'll be on the roof, won't it? And nope, the roof. There's nothing on the roof. Can I, can I get back in the train and just leave? It says humans only. I forgot. Friggin' androids in this city have their own personalized trains. Right. Okay, I can't leave this area until I find it. Got like a 
And for everyone asking, I uh, yes, I am aware of the echoing in my background and how annoying that can be at times. I've tried looking up tutorials and how to fix that online, but nothing has helped me so far. I think it's just a problem with the broadcast that it keeps doing that. I understand that's the reason a lot of people don't watch these videos and it and it's kind of disheartening in a way because uh, I would like more people to watch these videos but understand the minute they hear the echo in the background it pisses them off and annoys them I'm not sure whether it's a problem with my headset or a problem with my controller or whether it's neither of them and it's just the broadcast in general Right, it says next graffiti. And for everyone asking, I oh, it's a lion! It took me a minute there to realise that was a lion. Oh shit, okay. I have to look for the lion and the painting. I think it's just a problem with the broadcast that it keeps doing that. I understand that's the reason a lot of people don't watch these videos. And it, and it's kind of disheartening in a way because uh, I would like more people to watch these videos but understand the minute they hear the echo in the background it pisses them off and annoys them. I'm not sure whether it's a problem with my headset or a problem with my controller or whether it's neither of them or it's just the broadcast in general. Right, we're in the hell. I can't go down the stairs. It won't let me go down the stairs. Blend in with the humans. How the hell did I do that? Oh, it's a lion! It took me a minute to realise that was a lion! Right, how did I blend in with the humans? Blend in with the humans. Right, yes. Blend on. Right, I see the oh shit.
Oh my goodness, my thing wasn't down that whole time. My headset was above my head, meaning that the audio was muted. Right. I need to I need to look for this other friggin' symbol. Is it above me somewhere? Ah, there it is. The next graffiti is a robot on the wall. Right, there's a robot on the wall, which means it's over here somewhere. Find it, okay, I'm going the wrong way. goodness my thing wasn't down that whole time my headset was above my head meaning that the audio was muted right I need to, I need to look right. for this other friggin that's behind symbol. that's behind a sign is it above me somewhere ah there it is Right, these two are playing basketball in the park. It's an next graffiti and a robot on the wall. Right, there's a robot on the wall, which means it's over here somewhere. My headset was echoing like crazy there about five minutes ago, and that was and that was starting to get really, really annoying. So I do apologise for that, guys, because it was starting to get annoying. It was starting to get pretty annoying for me, too, the way it kept doing that. It's, uh, it's still echoing, but it seemed to help a bit. I turned, I turned off the HDR high dynamic range HUD. I'm not entirely sure how to stop the echoing completely. Right, where is this? Right, these two a are robot. The in the park. Right, I've already been down here. That's the place I came from. Right, I need to look for a place that says... Give him money. Or, or don't. Just keep walking past homeless. Oh! Crazy there. Is this it? Ah, there it is. And I, was I walked to right really, past really it. Annoying. So I do apologise for that, guys, because it was starting to get annoying. It was starting to get pretty annoying for me, too, the way it kept doing that. Right, one of my symbols is obstructed. So how did... I still echo him, but it seemed to help a bit. I turned I turned off the HDR high dynamic range HUD. Marcus, sure you look so suspicious what you're doing right now. Right, where is this? Right, these two are robots. Right, I've already been down here, that's the place I came from. Right, I need to look for a place that says Alright, if you look so suspicious, what? Or, or don't. Just keep walking past homeless. Oh! Crazy there. Is this it? Ah, oh, there it is. I walked right past it. Oh. There you go. Got three out of three. Right, now it's a, now it's a building of a black woman. Right, oh, it's right across the street here, isn't it there? She is right there. Marcus, you look so suspicious what you're doing right now. Oh, there's one up there. There's bound to be another one on her face somewhere. 
find a way to reach the roof. I mean, every good android uses dumpsters to climb. I bet Terminator did it at one stage as well. Holy shit. You're extremely agile, my friend. Right, oh, it's right across the street here, isn't it? There she is, right there. What are you doing? Are you go what the fuck are you doing? There's one up there. Oh. Find another one on our feet somewhere. Oh. Find a way to reach the roof. Oh. Okay, that was that's pretty cool. Right, it's one that says sparkle. I mean, every good android uses dumpsters to climb. I bet Terminator did it at one stage as well. Holy shit. You're extremely agile, my friend. Right, there's another one of those symbols. Not really too sure what these symbols mean, but hopefully the game tells me at some stage. And doesn't leave me hanging. Oh, is that one down here? There we go. What the fuck you doing? Right, I have to actually go inside the place now. Oh. Hey, what's this? Oh. Not be solid enough. Okay, that was, that was pretty cool. Right, it's one that says sparkle. Ah, be too unstable. Not really too sure what these symbols mean, but hopefully the game tells me at some stage. It doesn't leave me hanging. Oh, is that one down here? Damn, my man Marcus doing some heavy duty parkour. Oh, you see the ladder's gonna break, isn't it? I have to actually go inside the place now. Okay, let's execute the route, Marcus. Look at him, my man's doing parkour. Damn, he got up pretty high, didn't he? Into this abandoned friggin' warehouse of sorts. Probably Coca Cola's old factory. Be too unstable. Damn, my man Marcus doing some heavy duty parkour. Oh, you see the ladder's gonna break, isn't it? Right, I have to actually go inside the place now. Okay, let's execute the route, Marcus. 